Whoa, another session of the Faith Minute. Uh, welcome. I'm Pastor Winston Watson, and I, I, I was thinking yesterday, um, through some circumstances that we faced, I was thinking yesterday, um, I, 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 I really wasn't thinking about it, to be frank with you. I guess the Lord brought it to my memory. Many, many years ago, probably about 30 years ago, <laughs> to be frank with you, um, I worked as an assistant vice president um, at Chemical Bank in New York City. I was in Wall Street. Uh, I was a young 20-something-year-old um, MBA grad from college, and uh, you know, I was hired. I got into, into my job position, got promoted, and uh, I enjoyed myself but I was really wet behind the ears. I was proud, I had attitude, I was, you know, I was probably sickening to people around me. One lady, uh, one of our secretaries came to me one day and said, you know, I, 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 I think you're full of yourself. <laughs> uh, 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 the black girl that worked, worked with us, you know, we were friends, but she said that anyway, amen. Good friends tend to really address you the way you ought to be addressed. And, uh, I remember when I first became an AVP, I was making about, um, what I think it was over $60,000 a year. And this was many, many moons ago. So, and I was making at least $20,000 more than my peers that were either assistant treasurers or assistant vice presidents in our department. And uh, I didn't really know that exactly at the time, but every year, at least twice for the year, they would give uh, a bonus for extraordinary activity, extraordinary work. And uh, the first year that I was the AVP for the area, um, my colleagues got bonuses. I mean, anything from two to three to four, five thousand dollar bonuses, you know, on their checks. And nobody gave me a bonus. And I'm wondering, hey. What's going on? And I'm starting to think, well, maybe it's because of my skin color. Maybe it's because of this. Maybe it's because of that. Every excuse under the sun came to my mind. And then I went and I lodged a complaint with my vice president, who, you know, who I reported to. And he sat me down and he said something that was really interesting. He said, Winston, you have an MBA. You are performing at the level of your MBA. You have experience. You're performing at the level of your experience. He said, these other guys that you see here, first, they have no degree whatsoever. Number two, they don't have behind you what you have in the sense of experience and, and as I said, education and some of the other things you have going for you. Then they don't make anything close to your salary. They are, this is how I found out that I was making around a $20,000 um, salary difference. And he said, they are not making the salary you are. And so in order to give them an opportunity to earn some more, I submit them for bonuses um, during the year. But you must also remember, you are just performing at the level that we expect you to. And you are extremely well provided for in salary. I never thought about it like that. I just said that I was being overlooked. I just thought that I was not getting, you know, what I ought to get, the recognition I ought to get. I just thought that there was so, something else in the works, in the atmosphere. That's very childish. And one of the sessions that I just um, shared with you, uh, and I said, it's time, if you remember the scripture, when I was a child, I spoke about childish matters. Uh, for I saw things like a child and reasoned things like a child. But I have to stop sometimes and I have to think, is this an adult perspective? Is this a mature perspective? Or is this a child's immature and unspiritual perspective? That day my thoughts changed. That day, my actions changed. That day, my relationship with my peers changed. That day, I grew up. 
And that day, God had an opportunity to truly adjust the level of pride and the level of humility. <laughs> and the balance was different now. And he gave me an opportunity to live like the king. In about, uh, I think it was about six months, I received a $10,000 raise. And uh, I then, at, at, in the mid-twenties, my mid-twenties in years, I was making some 70,000 US dollars a year as a kid, really just out of college, you know, and uh, yes, I did have some experience because of in college, I worked in the college um, information technology area, but God did some tremendous things and arrested my heart and took me from childish behavior into maturity. God bless you. See you next time.